This is the second video on glomerular filtration rate on the determinants, glomerular co filtration coefficient, Bowman's capsule hydrostatic pressure, and glomerular colloid osmotic pressure. Please remember that none of these are the primary determinants of GFR. That is, they are not the primary variables which affect the glomerular filtration rate. The filtration coefficient. is 12.5 ml per minute per millimeters of mercury and it is a permeability of surface area and product of permeability and surface area of the glomerular capillaries. It is adversely affected by two conditions. One is diabetes mellitus and second is hypertension, both of which are when they are not under controlled and chronic diabetes mellitus causes deposition of AGEs AGEs in the glomerular capillaries and damages the glomerular capillaries and thereby decreases the GFR what is What are AGEs? AGEs are advanced glycated end products, a form of products which are formed when diabetes mellitus is not controlled optimally for a long time. Hypertension causes increased pressures, cause thickening of the glomerular capillaries. The process is known as glomerular sclerosis or nephrosclerosis and it again damages the glomerular capillaries and negatively affects the GFR. The Bowman's capsule hydrostatic uh, pressure negatively influences the GFR it itself is increased by renal calculi. If there is a calculi in the uh, urinary tract, in the ureter, that will cause back pressure changes and increase the Bowman's capsule hydrostatic pressure that will decrease the GFR. The arterial colloid osmotic pressure is around 28 millimeters of mercury and it directly affects the glomerular colloid osmotic pressure. So if the arterial colloid osmotic pressure increases, the glomerular colloid osmotic pressure will increase. At the efferent arteriole, it is 28 millimeters of mercury. Now filtration fraction. That is fraction of the renal plasma flow that becomes the glomerular filtrate. Fraction of the renal plasma flow that becomes the glomerular filtrate, it is approximately 20%. So 20% of proteins is filtered out of 28 millimeters of mercury. So in the efferent arteriole, the value of the osmotic pressure rises to 36 and if we take the average the glomerular colloid osmotic pressure is 32 millimeters of mercury if there is an increase in filtration fraction then there is an increase in glomerular colloid osmotic pressure and as a result there will be a decrease in gfr on the other hand if there is a decrease in the filtration fraction there will be an increase in the there will be a decrease in the glomerular colloid osmotic pressure and there will be an increase in gfr so filtration fraction inversely affects the gfr so now we have studied the filtration coefficient which is adversely affected by diabetes mellitus and hypertension the Bowman's capsule hydrostatic uh, pressure which is increased by renal calculi damaging the glomerulus uh, the glomerular colloid osmotic pressure which is affected by the arterial colloid osmotic pressure and the filtration fraction 
increase infiltration fraction increases pi gc and decreases gfr decrease in filtration fraction in, uh, decreases the pi gc and increases the gfr please remember that none of these are the primary determinants of gfr thank you i am dr swapnil